hi guys thank you for joining me for another video now this one is a little bit special to me because this is my favorite gel polish ever and it's burgundy from halo um and i just absolutely adore this color i could wear it all year round um but i try not to because i like to have different nails but it's just stunning so I'm going to do two coats of this, curing, curing in between, and then I will go in with my Crystal Nails Matte Ever um, Matte Top Coat, which doesn't have a dispersion layer, and then I will be going in with 3D. So now that's all cured and everything, I'm going to use Glam and Glitz Karen, which has a very slight shimmer to it, and I haven't used Glam and Glitz for ages, but I wanted a bright yellow, um, which wasn't like a pastel bright, so this was kind of the perfect tone I was going for for the sunflower. So I'm just placing on a bead and then dragging it to a point, waiting for it to set up a little bit. And then going in with my brush um, in a flat angle to try and just spread out the bottom of that bead and as you can see there using the edge of my brush to create that spine in the middle of the petal and just pressing it out until I'm happy with it and I will just keep repeating this until um, I've got half a layered sunflower
so now that's all completed um, I'm just gonna go in with some CJP pomegranate and add a little bit of shading because it was quite difficult to see that it was um, layered well you can see it's layered but I just wanted to add a little bit more definition to the petals because um, yeah, I just thought it looked good <laughs> um, then after that I'm going to use the same CJP pomegranate to create the center of the flower so just taking a nice round bead I just checked there and it was a bit too big so I swiped it off and went in again um, and got a bit of a smaller bead so then just placing that on in a circle making sure it covers everywhere I want it and I just let that set a little bit and I will come in with my dotting tool and I will dip it into the pomegranate acrylic before um, using it on the design so it doesn't stick to the acrylic and just make it a mushy mess so you can see there it has the acrylic on it and I just keep pressing into the acrylic to create this dimpled effect until I'm happy with it and it's starting to set. So I actually was just going to do the sunflower design originally and I thought mm, it looks a bit plain, um, I mean if it was a full set you could do the other side of the flower on the um, opposite side nail. Um, so I just went in with some Swarovski crystals and I'm using Fire Opal in SS12 because um, that's all I have in and Tangerine which is has mixed sizes and I'm just using my Glitter Planet nail glue let me just check what it's called it is just their nail glue uh, instant nail glue and it comes in a 15 gram bottle and it's just amazing I love this glue so much it sticks my tips down super fast and I'm just using a wax pencil because that was the closest one to me to apply them and then once that has all dried and everything that now is complete I hope you loved this video as much as I did um, I just think it's such a cute autumn design um, but keeping it a bit floral um, and feminine so thank you so much for watching and I will see you all again very soon take care bye